contrarian, leave it to contrarian badass Reggie Middleton. She called the housing crash. She called the collapse of Bear Stearns and Lehman Brothers and the crisis in the Eurozone banking system. One of the things uh, I get asked a lot about, and you've touched on a little bit, is the security of the different exchange portals. And basically, when I enter the cryptoverse and I obtain whatever it is, Ethereum, Veritasium, Bitcoin, how do I keep it secure? You know, because essentially, as an individual investor, that's, that's one of my biggest concerns is, you know, what wallet should I have it on? What platform should I be using? And from what I heard, it sounded like Veritasium is actually has a strong advantage uh, compared to the rest of the market in the sense that it's not hosted on these huge uh, exploitable exchanges. Mm -hmm. Is that, you know, accurate? Well, the nature of a decentralized exchange makes it autonomous. Autonomous means able to act on its own sovereign. Um, if you rely on a third party, then it's heteronymous, meaning you must rely on somebody else. Now, I, I don't want to denigrate the exchanges. I know the big ones like Coinbase seems to have, you know, they seem to have their security, you know, on par. But it's still centralized. So if the IRS decides that, right. you know, they win their lawsuit, right. and they decide to uh, get access to records, and they are not happy with the speed or rate that Coinbase delivers the records, mm. you know, Judgment comes in, boom. Mm -hmm. Or they could get hacked, or somebody on the inside can get access to multi signature, you know, cold wallet. Mm -hmm. It's happening with Bitfinex, mm -hmm. which was, uh, you know, seemingly a very professional organization mm -hmm. that had multi sig and cold storage mm -hmm. and still got took to 256 million. Wow. Um, most, when you relinquish the ownership of your private keys, you can just that. So, crypto assets, most of them are bare assets very similar to dollars, okay? And this is not as safe as it could be in my pocket, but you know, I'm a fighter, so <laughs> it's safe enough, you know, if you come for it, you got to come with a little something extra, right? But if I take my $5 bill and I give it to you, mm. I have relinquished possession, ownership, and custody of that $5 bill. So I have to trust you to do the right thing with it. Right. Okay? Right. So you bring your girlfriend to dinner and you get that extra little $5 dessert. What am I to say? I gave it to you. Right. Okay, it's my fault. Right. So on that note, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, I did the crypto thing and I regained possession, custody, and control of my assets. Yeah. Um, so with crypto being bearer assets, the security portion, most security errors are usually the error on part of the user. A lot less people lose their capital from hacks on right. server, right, right, other right. people's servers, etc. Right. Most of them do things like make a password called password, which I thought was a joke when I heard it the first time. Like 30%? <laughs> 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 then, you crazy. know, well, I'm not going to point out, but if you look around, um, I just happened to come in and there was actually, I'm going to correct them, um, there's an office in here and they have the password to one of their accounts written on the glass. Wow. Password is. And I'm looking like, doesn't that negate the right. reason of having a password when you right. write where everybody can see the password is? Right. So it's interesting. Um, you have to act as if you're paranoid and they're really after you. Right. Because you're not paranoid and they are really after you. And the larger your account is, right. and you could go through a blockchain explorer and see large accounts, the more economic incentive there is for someone to take it. Mm -hmm. You know, so if it's like forty, fifty thousand is one thing. You know, five or six billion dollars, you know, that's a honey pot and people are after it, you know? And um, nothing's unhackable, but you frustrate hackers by frustrating them. You know. Mm -hmm. They know it's possible to get it at some point, but if you have to expend six billion dollars worth of effort to get uh, four hundred million dollars worth of right. assets, right, right, right. they'll rather go and find a person to put password. Right. Yeah, I, re I remember hearing that in one of your videos. You said if it was uh, made, then it can be broken. Right. Essentially. You yeah, know, the unhappy so. thing, I don't believe. That's like the unbuildable. So right, right, right. Right. Down, right. Break it down. Exactly. Exactly. If your mind can conceive it, it yeah. can achieve it, and somebody yeah. else can reverse engineer it. Yeah. Most likely, you got standing right behind you, right? Now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Looking over your shoulder. Yeah. <laughs>